Democracy Now! Thank you. It's an honor to be here. It's great to have you with us. So what is this campaign all about? Uh, this campaign is about bringing corporations to uh, establish a different way of doing business. We're asking them to be responsible and to pay uh, premium pay to address the sub-poverty wages that workers have received. Today, for example, a worker received uh, for a 32-pound bucket of tomatoes around 45 to 50 cents. Um, and there's been many abuses going on in the fields, like sexual harassment, situations of discrimination, verbal and physical abuse, and uh, many other issues that need to be addressed. In the extreme, there's been cases of slavery. So what we're asking corporations to do is to work with us in addressing these issues by conditioning their purchasing under what we call the Fair Food Program, which is uh, enclosed in this little booklet that's been distributed in every farm now that the tomato industry represented by the Florida Tomato Growers Exchange have signed an agreement with the coalition to establish all of these new rights um, because of the market power that's behind it. Um, so we're asking Wendy's to join with us and to work to implement also uh, the Fair Food Program to, to work with us in enforcing. And who, um, who created the Fair Food Program? Oh, that's a very good question. The Fair Food Program was created by the worker community. Uh, we created the rights uh, including, included in this booklet. For example, there's a right, uh, the right to uh, have a clock in the fields because many times when you went to the fields you had to wait and that time was not accounted for. Uh, now it has to be. Uh, also the right to don't overfill the bucket, which is uh, a right that uh, represents, as it is right now, 10 percent less tomatoes um, that before you have to just give for free. The right to work um, with a committee on health and safety in the fields where you are working, where workers uh, have a voice now in the workplace to talk about how to eliminate threats to their health, uh, their safety, obviously, but also to improve the environment in which you are working. Gerardo, you